Hi, I'm Niall from Gulfstream Boat Sales. Today we're taking a look at a Quicksilver 630 SD pilot house boat. Um, this boat was built in 2006. It's only run 75 hours from new um, and it is in absolutely pristine condition. Um, I really can't sing its praises highly enough. It is totally immaculate in every regard from the trailer to the top of the wheelhouse. What we're going to do now is I'll take you through the boat, show you all the features on board, give you a good look around. Uh, we'll put the boat in the water as well, show you how it runs on our way. Um, and hopefully you can make a decision on whether this might be the right boat for you. You'll notice here, this is obviously the stern drive boat. You get a lot of these boats, these, these Quicksilver Pilot House boats without board power. Uh, and they would certainly be more common than the, the stern drive model. But to my mind, the stern drive is definitely the way to go, given that first and foremost it's di diesel, so the fuel economy is going to beat a petrol outboard hands down any day. And also, it keeps the stern of the boat nice and clear, particularly if you're fishing off the boat, means if you've got a, a line out over the back, you're not going to get snagged around the engine. Whenever you come on board then, the first thing you notice is the, the sheer size of the cockpit. Uh, this boat's just over 22 feet long and it's got a beam of almost eight and a half feet um, and the, the cockpit extends right out to the full width of the, of the boat. Coming forward then up onto the foredeck, we've got a handrail on the roof of the, the pilot house and you've also got nice high guard rails here that come up to sort of thigh level. So um, if you're coming up here whenever you're out on the water, um, you feel nice and safe. The pilot house is a really good size. Um, it's nice and bright and airy. Um, We've got seating in here for two. There's standing room for at least another one or two people. Um, and we've also got a little cuddy area uh, down at the lower level um, that uh, converts into a couple of berths. Uh, how we do that is you just lift up the two foot rests on both the, the helm and, and passenger side. That extends the, the beds. The engine itself just looks like new. The bilges are, the bilges are totally clean. We've got an automatic fire extinguisher down there and an automatic bilge pump. We've got a nice big uh, fuel water separator filter on there. Um, and the, this is a really, a really good power plant for this, this type and size of boat. Like I said, you'll see it yourself in the video footage, but the boat gets up on the plane in no time at all. It runs right up to over 30 knots um, and it has a really efficient sort of cruising speed of around about 20 knots, which is ideal for a boat of this size. Uh, fuel economy is fantastic. If you think that this was a useful video, it helps us if you could just like it on YouTube or leave a comment or something. Uh, it helps our rankings on, the, on YouTube. Um, and if you think there's anything I missed or there's anything we can do better, we're always delighted to, to hear from you. If you want to see the full length video of this boat, um, where we go through everything in detail, show you plenty of footage of the boat running in the water, you can hear the engine going, then just go to gulfstreamboatsales.com and sign up for VIP access. It's completely free. You just put your name and email address in and then you can navigate back to the page that this boat's on and you can see the full length video tour. Thank you for watching.